वेलकम टू डिजिटल लर्निंग डीसीई माय सेल्फ सुनीता एम एस असिस्टेंट प्रोफेसर डिपार्टमेंट ऑफ मैथमेटिक्स इन दिस वीडियो वी आर गोइंग टू लर्न द चैप्टर डिफरेंशियल कैलकुलस अंडर दट द टॉपिक ऑफ डिस्कशन इज फाइंडिंग द एक्सट्रीम वैल्यूज ऑफ एफ ऑफ एक्स कामा वाई इन द प्रीवियस वीडियो ऑलरेडी डिस्कस a definition of maxima and minima necessary and sufficient condition for extreme values working rule some examples on finding extreme values so let us discuss problem on this find the extreme values so f of x comma y is equal to x cube plus 3x y square minus 3x square minus 3y square plus 4 So differentiate partially with respect to x. Derivative of x cube is three x square plus three x y square. Differentiation is three y square minus derivative of three x square is minus six x. So three y square and four are the constants. Differentiate the function partially with respect to y. So differentiation of three x y square is six x y minus Three y square के differentiation six y. The necessary and sufficient condition we have differentiate if x is equal to zero and if y is equal to zero. So if x is divided by three, we get x square plus y square minus two x equal to zero and divided by six, we get x y minus y is equal to zero. So x y minus y y is to common y into x minus one equal to zero equal to zero we get x equal to one and y equal to zero put x equal to one to the equation x square plus y square minus two x equal to zero we get x square is one one plus y square minus two is equal to zero y square minus one equal to zero therefore y equal to plus or minus One, the critical points are one comma one and one comma minus one. Put y equal to zero to the equation x square plus y square minus two x equal to zero. Then x square minus two x equal to zero. X is the common. X into x minus two equal to zero. If we equate zero, x equal to zero and x equal to two. Therefore, the critical points are zero comma zero. And two comma zero. Now a is equal to f x x mean differentiate partially f x with respect to x get six x minus six. B is equal to f x y differentiate f x partially with respect to y we get six y. C is equal to f y y differentiate f y partially with respect to y we get Six x minus six. So now compute a c minus b square is equal to a c six x minus six whole square minus b square is six y whole square. At origin, a c minus b square is equal to a c minus b square at x equal to zero. We get thirty six. So thirty six is greater than zero. And also a is equal to put x equal to zero, we get minus six. Minus six is less than zero. And check out at two comma zero, a c minus b square is equal to at x equal to two, twelve. Twelve minus six is six. Six whole square is thirty six. Thirty six is greater than zero. And a is equal to at x equal to two, twelve. Twelve minus six is six. Six is greater than Zero at one comma one, a c minus b square is equal to six x at six six minus six is zero, and six six into one is one six six whole square is minus thirty six thirty six is less than zero. At one comma minus one, a c minus b square is equal to minus thirty six is less than zero. At origin, 
both x and y are 0 then we get ac minus b square greater than 0 and a is less than 0. Therefore, f of x comma y has a maximum at origin and maximum value of the function we put function put x equal to 0 and y equal to 0 we get 4 at 2 comma 0 ac minus b square greater than 0 and a greater than 0 therefore f of x comma y as a minimum at 2 comma 0 and minimum value of f of x comma y is put x equal to 2 and y equal to 0 to the given equation we get 8 minus 12 plus 4 is equal to 0. The remaining two points 1 comma 1 and 1 comma minus 1 at which ac minus b square less than 0. So less than 0 then we called as sad loop points. Find the extreme value so f of x comma y is equal to 1 plus sine of x square plus y square. But to differentiate partially with respect to x and equal to 0 and partially with respect to y equal to 0. If we partially with respect to x, we get derivative of psi is cos, cos of x square plus y square. So differentiation of x square is 2x. So fx is 2x cos x square plus y square equal to 0. And fy differentiate partially with respect to y. Differentiation of psi is cos, cos of x square plus y square. Partially with respect to y square is 2y is equal to 0. Therefore, x equal to 0 and y equal to 0. Therefore, the critical point is 0, 0. Now, a is equal to differentiate fx partially with respect to x. Again, is equal to, we apply the product rule. So, 2x is the first function, cos of x square plus y square is the second function. So, 2x, derivative of cos is minus sin x square plus y square. Partially with respect to x is 2x. So, 2x into 2x is 4x square plus second function into 2 cos of x square plus y square with respect to x is 1. And b is equal to fxy. Differentiate partially fx with respect to y. So, with respect to y, keeping 2x is the constant, differentiation of cos is minus sin x square plus y square. So, partially with respect to y is 2y. So, 2 into 2y into 2x is 4xy. c is equal to f yy means differentiate partially fy with respect to y. So, apply the product rule. 2y is the first function. Cos of x square plus y square is the second function. Differentiation of cos is minus sin x square plus y square with respect to y square is 2y. So, 2y into 2y is 4y square plus 2 cos of x square plus y square is the second function with respect to y is 1. At origin, origin is the critical point. a is equal to put x equal to 0 and y equal to 0. Then a becomes sin 0 is 0. So, a, a is equal to 2. Cos 0 is 1. And b is equal to those x equal to 0, y equal to 0. Then it becomes b is equal to 0. c is equal to 2. Then c becomes 2. ac minus b square is equal to 2 into 2 is 4. b value 0. So, ac minus b square equal to 4. 4 is greater than 0. And a becomes a positive value, so greater than 0. So, ac minus b square greater than 0 and a greater than 0. Hence, f of x comma y is minimum at origin. For the minimum value is, put x equal to 0 and y equal to 0 to the given function, we get 1.
go to next problem find the extreme values of f of x comma y that is x cube y square 1 minus x minus y so given function is multiplied by x cube y square then x cube y square minus x cube y square into x get x to the power 4 y square minus x cube y square multiplied by y is x cube y cube the necessary condition differentiate x differentiate the function f partially with respect to x and partially with respect to y equal to 0 so differentiate the function partially with respect to x keeping y square is constant the derivative of x cube is 3x square minus keeping y square is constant the derivative of x power 4 is 4x cube minus y cube is constant keeping fixed constant derivative of x cube is 3x square equal to 0 and fy means differentiate the function f partially with respect to y keeping x cube is constant partially with respect to y square is 2y minus x to the power 4 is constant y square get derivative 2y minus x cube is constant derivative of y cube is 3y square equal to 0 in fx x square y square is the common so 3 minus 4x minus 3y equal to 0 and in fy x cube y is constant so common 2 minus 2x minus 3y is equal to 0 if we equal to 0 then it becomes x equal to 0 y equal to 0 4x plus 3y is equal to 3 and x equal to 0 y equal to 0 2x plus 3y is equal to 2. From the base of equation we have to find critical points. So x equal to 0 we get y equal to 0. So x equal to 0 2x plus 3y equal to 2 y equal to 0 2x plus 3y equal to 2 4x plus 3y equal to 3 x equal to 0, 4x plus 3y equal to 3, y equal to 0, 4x plus 3y equal to 3 and 2x plus 3y equal to 2. The stationary points are, if you put x equal to 0, y equal to 0, then origin is the stationary point. Put x equal to 0, we get y is equal to, put x equal to 0, y is equal to 2 by 3, for 0 comma 2 by 3. Put y equal to 0, x equal to 1, therefore 1 comma 0. 4x plus 3y equal to 3. Put x equal to 0, y becomes 1. So 0 comma 1. 4x plus 3y equal to 3, y equal to 0. So if you put y equal to 0, then x equal to 3 by 4. Therefore 3 by 4 comma 0. So 4x plus 3y equal to 3 and 2x plus 3y equal to 2. So, solving these two equation and subtracting, so 3y, 3y get cancelled. 4x minus 2x is 2x. 2x equal to 1, therefore x equal to 1 by 2. And substituting one of the equation, we get y is equal to 1 by 3. Next, we compute a is equal to fxx. Means, differentiate fx partially with respect to x. b is equal to fxy partially with respect to y c is equal to f y by means differentiate f y partially with respect to y and we take common 6 y square that is 1 minus 2 x minus y 6 x square minus x square y is the common 6 minus 8 x minus 9 y 2 x cube is the common 1 minus x minus 3 y Then we compute AC minus B square. So we multiply AC then B value minus B whole square. First we check out at origin 
and 0, 2 by 3, 1, 0, 0, 1, 3 by 4, 0. Here, AC minus B square is the product. So, if put X equal to 0 or Y equal to 0, then the value AC minus B square becomes 0. If AC minus B square equal to 0, we cannot say that the function is maximum or minimum. Therefore, we shall examine the nature of the point 1 by 2, comma 1 by 3. At this point, AC minus B square is equal to, put X equal to 1 by 2 and Y is equal to 1 by 3. Then we simplify, we get 1 divided by 144. 1 divided by 144 is this positive value greater than 0. And A is equal to minus 1 by 9 is less than 0. Hence, 1 by 2 comma 1 by 3 is a maximum point and maximum value of the function f of x comma y. Put x equal to 1 by 2, y equal to 1 by 3 to the given equation is we get 1 divided by 432. Find the extreme values of f of x comma y is equal to x cube plus y cube minus 3x minus 12y plus 20. So given equation f of x comma y is equal to x cube plus y cube minus 3x minus 12y plus 20. The necessary condition differentiate the function partially with respect to x and partially with respect to y equal to 0. If you differentiate partially with respect to x, derivative of x cube is 3x square y cube is 0 constant minus 3x get derivative minus 3 minus 12y plus 20 constant equal to 0. Differentiate partially with respect to y derivative of y cube is 3 by square minus 12y derivative is minus 12 equal to 0. If we divide divided by 3 then we get x square minus 1 equal to 0 divided by 4 so, y square minus 4 equal to 0. If we divide divided by 3, we get y square minus 4 equal to 0. That is, x equal to plus or minus 1 and y equal to plus or minus 2. The four critical points are, we take positive values first, 1 comma 2 and 1 comma minus 2. Then, negative values minus 1 comma 2 and minus 1 comma minus 2. 2. Let a is equal to differentiate partially fx with respect to x. We get derivative of 3x square is 6x. b is equal to fxy. Differentiate the function fx partially with respect to y. There is no term of y is equal to 0. c is equal to differentiate the function fy partially with respect to y. We get 6 phi. AC minus B square equal to 6X into 6 y B is 0 that is 36 X y. We check at the point 1 comma 2 AC minus B square is equal to at X equal to 1 Y equal to 2. So 36 into 1 into 2 equal to 72. 72 is greater than 0. A is equal to at X equal to 1 a equal to 6, 6 is greater than 0. At point 1 comma minus 2, put x equal to 1, y equal to minus 2, then ac minus b square is equal to minus 72, is less than 0. But a is equal to 6x is put x equal to 1, 6, 6 is greater than 0. At minus 1 comma 2, ac minus b square is 36 into minus 1 into 2 equal to minus 72 less than 0. A is equal to 6x. Put x equal to minus 1 minus x greater than 0. That is A is equal to minus 6. Minus 6 is less than 0. At minus 1 comma minus 2. AC minus B square is equal to 36 into minus 1 into minus 2 equal to 72. 72 is greater than 0. So, A is equal to 
minus 6 minus 6 is less than 0 at 1 comma 2 ac minus b square greater than 0 and a greater than 0 therefore f of x comma y as a minimum at point 1 comma 2 and minimum value of the given function put x equal to 1 y equal to 2 we get 1 plus 8 minus 3 minus 24 plus 20 equal to 2 at point minus 1 comma minus 2 ac minus b square greater than 0 and a less than 0 therefore f of x comma y as a maximum at point minus 1 comma minus 2 and maximum value of f of x comma y is put x equal to minus 1 put y equal to minus 2 to the given equation we get minus 1 minus 8 plus 3 plus 24 plus 20 equal to 38 the remaining two points that is minus 1 comma 2 and minus 1 comma minus 2 at which ac minus b square less than 0 if less than 0 then we called as saddle points thank you